Good morning viewers, I bought a fresh offer for you, this offer for Dash Rapid Egg Cooker with 6 egg capacity, this review by 9 Malls YouTube channel, don't forget to subscribe for fresh deals like these, let's go to the video. Hey what's going on everyone, welcome to the 9 Malls As Seen On TV and Gadget Review channel. Today I'm going to review a popular brand, I feel like whenever I review a Dash product, it gets a lot of uh, views, but this is the Dash Go Rapid Egg Cooker. Perfectly cooks six eggs at a time, and yeah, so I've reviewed something like this before. Never a name brand, it's kind of an off brand. Uh, this is bydash.com. Um, let's see, Go Fast or Easy Fast Fresh Rapid Egg Cooker. Serve the whole family. This includes six egg tray, makes perfectly cooked hard boiled eggs, no egg on your face. Handy measuring cup takes the guesswork out of making eggs. Perfect for every taste. Serve up omelets, hard boiled, soft boiled, poached, scrambled, or deviled eggs. And yeah, so let's open it up, see what's inside. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. Really appreciate that. And if you want to support my content, go to patreon.com slash nine malls. Uh, just support my channel there and you can get exclusive videos and all that's in the description so you can go sign up there and let's uh, open this up on the review try to make my intros quick I feel like they're a lot faster than most videos out there I feel like people come here for the review and not not the, the intro so all right, so Dashgo Rapid Egg Cooker. Pierce the bottom of each egg with the measuring cup. Fill water to desired line and pour onto heating plate. Place egg on, okay, soft boiled. Yeah, one soft boiled, one to three eggs, four to six minutes. So really quick. You have this kind of quick cooking guy, which I like. And then really, I mean, it's paper, but it's a nice, big, colorful, kind of recipe booklet guide. So that's kind of cool, deviled eggs. I might say that. All right, so what does the machine look like? We have the cord here. And I'm just looking in the, uh, the guide. So this is the cover. There's a steamer hole here. This is, yeah, the omelet po slash poaching tray. This is the boiling tray handle. So let's see. Oh, okay, okay. Cool. Actually, that's pretty cool. It goes in like so, I believe. And then you kind of lock it into place. And then so when it's done, you pick it up like that. That's pretty slick. Um, let's see here. This is the omelet bowl right here. Um, this is the boiling tray. Measuring cup. And I guess, oh, this is the cover. So the cover for the spike, <laughs> that's smart. All right, so it's all plugged in. And just for this test, I'm gonna do just one soft boiled, but I'm gonna do an omelet just to show you. All right, so I'm gonna fill it up to the water line, the soft water line here. All right, here we go. And then you pierce the bottom of each egg here, so do that. All right, did that, so there we go. And now press the button, turn to blue, which is kind of cool. Put this on, it's ready to go. All right, so I just started making this weird noise. I'm gonna unplug it. Uh, maybe it's done, maybe that means it's done. All right, so yeah, that was kind of weird, but let's test it out. It might've been an alarm, like it's getting too hot, because the water is kind of out, but I left it in for a little bit less than um, seven minutes. All right, so I'm gonna get some cold water here. All right, let me show you this. Peeled it under the sink. 
Let's get this fork here and cut it. And look at that. That's like the true definition of a soft boiled egg. Actually, not too bad. I mean, that's a little tiny bit softer than what I like, but yeah, that's pretty good. Maybe just a little bit more time, but not bad. All right, so next I am gonna cook an almond here. I'm gonna add more water this time to hopefully avoid that weird sound. All right, there we go. And I'm gonna take this little piece off here. And the directions just show you have this tray on here. You put in your little, let me wash this out again. Put this little tray right here. Um, add a little bit of oil. Okay. And just move that around. Then put the almond, have some an egg and then some jalapeno peppers. And let's put this back on. I guess we can lock it. Yeah, it locks. Okay. Press the button. Actually, plug it in. That would help. Okay, press the button. There we go. And it says, let me look at the directions here. But it says if you make this, you, I think you add two extra minutes. All right, so it's a little bit less than nine minutes, Alexa off. And I'm gonna take it out, just cause I don't want it to overcook. So here we go. Let's check this out. Gonna unlock it. So first I'm plug it. Lots of steam, that annoying sound and you know, didn't happen this time. So I think it was due to the lack of water, maybe it was overheating or something. And look at that, so looks nice and fluffy, light, and very, very hot. Let me get some, I'm just gonna kind of move it with my fingers. There we go, flip it over, and look at that. Actually did way better than I was expecting. Let's move this to the side here. And look at that. Add some uh, pepper here. Let's give it a taste test. Alexa, off. All right. Dash go omelet. Taste test. Yeah, not too bad. Um, I definitely prefer the pan method, um, but in a pinch, I guess this is fine. Uh, yeah, not the best almond I've ever had, but I would say a pan's better. Also, you're cooking in plastic, so if you've seen other reviews, I'm not a huge fan of you know cooking in plastic. So uh, yeah, probably pass on that. But as far as you know, cooking hard-boiled eggs, I think this thing works great. I have another product that is pretty much identical to this one. I'll show you, actually I'll get it out. So this is kind of just like the generic version of this. <laughs> That's what's amazing now is, you know, all products, you know, there are lots of different brand names. Let's see, it's simple taste, but this one works great. It's one of my favorite way to cook hard boiled eggs. And it looks like the dash is pretty much identical. Maybe it has more accessories, but pretty much identical to that one. So yeah, it's a good design, you know, I use it all the time. And yes, I do recommend the Dash Go uh, Rapid Egg Cooker. So thanks for watching my videos, everyone. If you like them, please continue following. If you want to support my content, go to patreon.com slash nine moles. Just search Patreon for the number nine, M-A-L-L-S. All right.